Okay, back to school week, so we better use the movie Back to School by Rod with Rodney Dangerfield. And I love his old one-liners. Uh, from this movie, The Shape My Body's In, I could donate it to science fiction. 20-minute EMOM. We're going to need to put 20 minutes on the clock. And uh, what we're going to have here is that the first two minutes are going to have a prescribed number of reps. And minute number three is a max effort. Okay. So with this one here, um, minute number one, we're going to have 10 weighted RDLs. So that's 10 per side. So we would start out right with our dumbbell and we would do 10 reps on the one leg. When we're done 10 on the one leg, we'll switch sides, right? Looking out ahead, 10 reps on the other. You're going to feel one heck of a fire going in the back of the legs right after you've done that. Okay, that should leave you about 15 seconds left, maybe 20, recoup, recover, minute number two comes along, and then minute number two, it becomes 20 alternating single leg box step ups with a dumbbell, holding a dumbbell. So we're here, we're onto the box, right, we're stepping up, full extension in those hips, right, we don't want to stay muted, we don't want to stay bent over, we want that fully open. So we're here and we're stepping onto that box for 20 reps. Okay, that's gonna pile up those legs a little bit more. Minute number three comes along, we've got our dumbbell. Now it becomes max rep single dumbbell thrusters. Now the only caveat to these thrusters is that you do 10 on one arm before you switch to the other. So we're gonna have a decent sized weight here because it's just a single dumbbell. If you would normally have 10s or 12s and you have a 15 kicking around, this would be a great time to grab a 15. If you normally use 20s, 25 isn't gonna be bad, or the 20 is fine, and you then get a lot of reps in. So our thruster, right, we're full depth squat, and we're pushing that up, right, and we're using that hip extension, right, that to get that energy from core to drive it to extremity, okay? Now the biggest thing is when we're doing that is we wanna breathe. All too often when we start pushing dumbbells overhead, we quit breathing, heart rates jack up, maybe over 200, right Crystal? Okay, so with that you would do 10 on the one arm. Once you're done 10 on the other one arm, you can switch to the other and you can resume doing those thrusters, okay? And the big thing with thrusters is that we still have to get that squat depth, okay? So, max rep dumbbell thrusters. Minute number four comes, record your score, grab your drink of water, reset, and get ready to go again for five rounds. Our score is the total number of single dumbbell thrusters. Push the pace, keep breathing, keep breathing, keep breathing with those thrusters. Good luck.